applied GD in engineering, mechanical, and Ventec and Veltec got rejection due to previous academic performance. So my case officer suggested me taking GD in operations and production management. So applied Ventec, you call and wet. I got an offer letter for the course in Ventec. My doubt is whether it comes under skill shortage list. Does it come under change of field, career opportunities? Does it affect my PR points? The fact is you did attempt to get into a particular course first, which was probably more suiting your background and your aspirations. But unfortunately, none of the institutions give you an offer. So this is a like a related, uh, I, I'm actually quite uh, happy with uh, uh, my case officer who suggested uh, this course, which is GD in operations and production management, because it is quite closely aligned to what is it that you really wanted to do. Uh, I would also like to suggest um, if you're, I don't know which intake you're planning, but uh, because you have an interest in uh, mechanical, also talk to your case officer and ask them to uh, check the possibility of getting you into the graduate diploma in uh, CAD CAM, which is, you know, computer aided design and computer aided manufacturing, which is again very closely related not only to mechanical engineering, but a lot of other engineering fields as well. So request your uh, case officer. And if uh, that particular case officer is listening to my broadcast right now, I would also recommend uh, him or her uh, to consider also applying for the graduate diploma in uh, CAD CAM, uh, which is, I think, a good, well, you know, good related course. And uh, yeah, I, I strongly recommend that. Uh, uh, yeah, as far as in the worst case scenario, uh, where if you do have to get into operations and production management, I don't think it's going to create much of a problem because at the least you'll go, you're going to get a, a two year uh, work visa in those two years if you can. And the fact is you already have a, a background in mechanical engineering. So there is a possibility, even if you do get a job related to mechanical engineering uh, as a licensed immigration advisor, uh, myself or Mary or Gisela uh, would be able to match and show why there is still a connect between your past qualification and the, the, the uh, uh, you know, the job that you've got. So there are ways and means of doing this. So I don't think you should uh, doubt yourself too much or the possibility or the career opportunities. Uh, there are a lot of people who come and take up this aligned courses rather than something in that particular field. So I don't really see a problem with that.